Now, since my live stream, I've played maybe four more ranked games. So this is actually going to be like 10 or 11 in a row. Not too sure. Excuse me. But shout out to Oh No, it's the D86. We're actually going to get ball first. I think I have it on receive and not kick, but it doesn't really matter, man. As long as we play good defense and get the stops we need, we're going to be okay. Make sure you guys drop a like on this video. Subscribe if you're new. Turn notifications on. All that handsome, good stuff. All right, so how are we going to attack this? We're in the Saints playbook on offense, Jets on defense. And uh, let's see if we can catch him slipping right off the rip. If not, if he's a better player than, than I expect, then... We'll play a little bit differently. Differently, Let's go ahead and see what he does. Probably going to be running cover three because let's face it, man. A lot of people love cover three defense. It's rare that I see anything else in these tiers right here. Well, actually, I don't know. This could be this could be in here. This looks like three, four, though, bro. Why is he running three, four right now? I don't know. I honestly don't know what this is. Did you see all the people running back right there? It was cover for a drop. That was weird. That really was weird. If he runs the same thing, we're going to take him over the top because the way he made that look was a little suspicious to me, man. I feel, I feel like maybe he was doing something to scare me. Right here, bro. This could be the move right here. You already know what time it is with this play, though. Me with the one-play TDs. Simple as that, man. It's just that easy. Cover four drop, you got to be careful. I feel like if you're going to be running cover four drop, you have to change the blues. And if you're not going to change the blues, you better blitz heavy because there's too many deep post routes that are going to smoke that defense, man. And it's, it's not pretty, to say the least. It really isn't pretty. So make sure that you're changing your blues. If you're gonna just run primarily zone out of that, like the way I do, I put the inside third, middle third. Um, but if you're not, stuff like that's gonna happen to you, bro. Like Tyree kills and these guys are just, they're dominant, man. They're like the OP players of the game and that's what I like to use. Now, I don't know what this guy's uh, scheme's gonna be. So we're gonna have to really just look at what he's bringing to the table and hopefully, hopefully be able to stop it. I don't really use a lot of nickel normal and I feel like I should, bro, you know? I know a lot of people like to use it. I might just use it just a little bit until I struggle. Once I struggle, I can, uh, you know, get off of it. But for the most part, unless he's coming out heavy with the run, which it looks like, let's just run cover for a drop. We're gonna, we're not gonna baseline. We're just gonna bring this guy out here, cloud it up like this. He's gonna run the stretch to the outside. Now, he's going to get away with these plays on the outside. I'm just looking at it. I'm seeing what he's doing, okay? If he stays in that offense, it will change it up uh, after a couple plays. Let's just get let's just get a look, get a feel for what he's doing, try to build a, you know what I'm saying? Looks, looks like he just wants to do that. So now I will base the line to get these guys on the outside. Yeah, he's going to do the same thing. So unless we can't stop him, he gets a touchdown. We actually get to stop. So you see what he's doing here. We're going to have to like be able to lock that up. We're going to have to take our chances trying to lock this up. And it's just uh, it's just something we're going to have to do. And it's unfortunate, bro. You know, wish he would have been a passer, man. I think it would have been. I think it would have been better. Would have been a lot better if this guy would just pass the ball to me personally. So, nice defense, man. So that's how you bottle up that stuff right there. Now, I don't know if he's still... I want to say that my man is probably going to do something else. So we're going to come out in the 3-4 odd. And I'm just going to run. My man still going to run the ball. Take him to the outside. Still wants to run the ball. There's not a lot I can do about that. It's just something, something that we got to deal with. He's going to have to deal with. He's going to have to, you know, like, there's people in this game. They're not going to pass the ball. 
That's split close. I don't know how I want to run this though, bro. That's the thing. He's got over over the middle though if he wants it. I messed up. He went for that on four from fifteen. He ran the ball, and I messed up on my adjustment. So that's my fault. See, this is what I don't get about guys, bro. Like. I guess he felt like he could get the first down running it rather than passing it. I would have taken my chance with the pass, bro. Not that far out. You got to be careful. So now we're in control with this drive. I'm going to try to catch him slipping right here. I'm not saying it's going to work, but he's he's going to be respected. He's back there waiting for it, too. Tyreek Hill route, bro. You're not watching. You're not paying attention. It's a one-play touchdown. You got to be careful. I'm reading what you're doing. I'm seeing what you're doing. You're making... Okay, look. Check this out. Oh, no. It's the D86. Let me just school you a little bit real quick, okay? Check this out. Too many adjustments in your cover three is going to hurt you in the end because... What am I doing? Because what I'm looking for is the backfield. I'm watching your blues. That When I snap the ball, I'm watching those blues in the back to see what they do. That's what I'm doing. That's When I snap the ball, I'm looking at the blues. Yeah, okay, if you're blitzing me heavy, okay, I got to worry about that. But if I can keep your pass rush under control to where I get leverage over the line, well, now I'm looking in the backfield. So what you need to do mentally, right, is to scare me at the line to prevent me from looking in the backfield. Does that make any sense? To you guys that are playing the game. Try to get my focus off the backfield. Like, put the blues out there. Uh, not necessarily having the user back there because that, that's that's hard in itself. Unless you're playing mud and everybody's 99 speed, right? Okay. But if you're working with a regs team, you have to play it completely different. This is nothing like ultimate team. This is bare bones pretty much. Not really bare bones. This is not like franchise where you can turn stuff off or ban stuff. But this is just like, you're not going to have three abilities on defense and three on offense. It's just not going to work that way. Now, I don't know what he's going to run here, but it's scaring me. Bro, okay? I ain't going to lie. It's scaring me. It's a little scary right here. I'm going to try to pick this up, whatever it is. Oh, nice pass rush, man. Our pass rush is actually getting there. Jones with the pass rush. I'm going to keep Matthew a little bit over here. I got to watch a deep post on the left side because Matthew won't be able to get over the top. I'm going to play sticks. Pass commit. Spread the D-line. This, this is how I'm rocking, okay? I'm watching this guy. Look at this, bro. That's a pick. Yeah, baby. I finally get to stick with one. You know what I mean? I finally get to stick with one of those. Okay. So, again, we come back to the same play because you haven't shown me. Look at that user. Look at that user. I belong in the 1%. I belong in the tournaments. I belong playing mutt top, right? We can lead. But, I mean, I just can't blow the money, bro. I just can't do it. You see how he's respecting my pass game? He's putting everybody back. See, when that happens in your mind, you're thinking, okay, well, he did that. Well, let's go ahead and audible into the run and try to get away. Now, here's the thing. One block shed and this run plays over. You know what I'm saying? Like, but he's respecting my deep routes. He's scared of them. So now he's he's making the adjustment for it. Let's go ahead and uh, keep it on the ground now. We're going to keep it on the ground. Let's try to score. Kill some time. Try to win the game like it's nothing. Make it easy. You know what I'm saying? Can you guys hit a like for just the flawless gameplay and just reading and trying to explain to you guys what I'm thinking? I'm gonna, I'll try to do a little bit more, a little bit better. Right here could be, still be covered too. He's pulling P out because he knows it's a stretch. But all I have to do, a simple adjustment for me is just to flip the stretch. All those adjustments he made, and now I can just come over here to the right with the stretch because that's stretch in general with the game. You know what I'm saying? So what are you going to do? You're bringing people out. You're bringing people out. And now you're on the wrong side. 
happen. Now I get a first down because the pinch dog two press, I don't think that defense in itself is strong enough to stop the stretch, if that makes any sense. It's just not strong enough to stop it. Back to the left. Now you see the guy he moved? I'm going to ID him on purpose. Let's cut this back inside. If my man, Whis New Whiskey, wouldn't have got him out. I don't know. I don't know how to say his name, bro. I really don't. Now let's go ahead and scare him a little bit with empty trio. And let's see what his defense does against the empty trio, okay? Because it depends on the defense he picks. And if these guys can shed off their blocks. This is actually smart of him. Look at this guy. Like, he's making... Look at his adjustments, man. Just moving around. You know? It's cool. I like to see it. But what is its value? I still get up the field, no matter what. Oh, he's running cover nine. Wow, okay. So, my man's got, like, a defense for everything that I'm running. It's just the execution behind it, the adjustments is not there. You're going to have to, like, get a little bit more sophisticated because I'm reading you, bro. Okay, that guy shedded. Nice. That was a nice shed by that guy. I'm going to go for it because I don't care, okay? This is for the... This is just for, for, for the Madden. Okay, this is for you guys right here. I'm just going to go for it on fourth two because that's what YouTube really wants to see, right? They don't want to see me kick the field goal, right? Usually, I do kick the field goal, and I'll go up 17-0. But since this since it's July, almost August, I'm gonna go ahead and just run the ball, bro. Now he's stuck on that side. Oh, oh, oh! I got it right. Yeah, I got it. Let's go. So can I get a light for that, homies? Can we get a light for that? Now you know what I haven't used a lot of. I'm gonna go ahead and put a strong power right here in the auto. I haven't really used a lot of the pistol bunch tight end, man. You guys really don't see me run that either. I'm always in gun off uh, wide trio. I'm in a uh, tight offset tight end. Not really on the other ones, man. Now he's the user. I'm gonna go ahead and ID him. Okay, well that guy's the user. Ooh, I ran right into that guy. My fault. Go ahead and try strong power. What do you guys say? Strong power on that side? Yeah, I agree. I agree. Whoa, what kind of block shed was that? You see that? My man just came right through the. I'm going to try something this far out that I don't really throw, bro. I don't really throw this route this far out. I usually do it at the six. We're just going to try it, okay? Fade. Streak. Look at this guy with all the crazy adjustments. Look, look at my man with all the crazy. Look at all the crazy adjustments. Look at this. He won't stop moving his defenders. Isn't that strange, bro? Isn't that like strange? Isn't that strange? All that just to get smoked by the sticking up with the route that no one ever guards. My man was actually in the area and still wouldn't guard the route. What's with all the maneuvering, bro? All that means nothing if your adjustments aren't on point. None of that means nothing. All that maneuvering and moving stuff around. What are you what are you trying to accomplish? Is what I put in the comments below. What are you trying to accomplish? If you move a curl flat around, the guy's still gonna go to where he's supposed to, and then he's still not gonna guard the crossing route or the corner route. You know what I'm saying? I don't know, maybe it's just to scare people. I used and in all honesty, homies, I used to be like that. I used to be that guy. Okay? I used to, until I realized, bro. My, my curls are still going to where they're supposed to, and they're still not guarding nothing. <laughs> Your purple still ain't doing nothing. Your clouds still ain't doing nothing. You're still getting glitched out in cover two. Just like that. Nothing, nothing too crazy. Nothing too crazy. Now I'm going to man a line right here. Taken down here at about the 11. 
Not bad. Not bad at all. Good defense. Good, nice stout defense. You saw what I did there, right? I base aligned my man defense so he wouldn't follow him. You see how he came back? He actually came back. And that that's what I wanted. That's what I wanted to see right there. I wanted to see him come back to where he was supposed to go. I base aligned out of that man defense. So he's probably gonna want to take his three if he goes for it. If I was him, I'd just take his three. He gets he gets ball at ball at half, so he's gonna be in good position to try to score again. The problem with what he's doing. Is it's going to take him too long, bro? You know what I'm saying? It's going to take him too long. I get to run out the clock as well. I'll be able to run the ball, run the clock down. And we're going to get into a game of, of time management. You know what I'm saying? We're going to get into a game where it's just time management. Who controls the ball longer? I'm going to try to take that on my side. And this is how I play the game of Madden. This is how I go on long win streaks. I'm not... From the start, I can gauge my opponent, right? And see just how good he's going to be and if if i see that he's not that good then i'll start taking them down the field over and over and over and over and over but if they're decent players then i'll focus on time management and running concepts and stuff like that but for the most part man this, this guy's really not a uh he's not a scaring me is what i'm trying to tell you guys man, i want to try to pick up a corner route bro that's really what i'm looking for Oh, nice defense, man. Our cover four drop isn't doing too bad. I'm blitzing people. I messed up. Let's go, man. I sent everybody, but I stuck on the line. We sent it right. That's the way you do it. Man, still going to run it to the outside. And we get ball. I don't get it. This is the thing with people in Madden 20. This is just a thing that it's the norm, running it. You know what I'm saying? Like running it on fourth down. Running it, it's just the norm. I don't know what it is about players that even in competitive, bro, the people that are competing for money, that play money games on Twitch, they do the same thing. They're just going to run the ball no matter what down it is. They could be down by four. And I know you've guys seen it. The guys that watch pro, I know you've seen it. I know you see these guys do that. It's third down, and they're still running the ball. They're down two possessions. Fourth quarter, still running the ball. It is, it is confusing to me, bro. I'm going to keep the ball on the ground, though. I'm going to try to see, like, if there's a corner out or something. Okay, he's going deep with this. I'll take this, man. I knew I saw that shit coming from a mile away. GG's to oh no, man. If I were you, I'd just quit, man. I think it's over. Okay, he's not going to quit. All right. I guess since we got ball back, this is like a free possession to me. We could probably try to take him down the field one time, right, to really just rub it in. You know what I'm saying? Let's just try to rub it in now. It's not really how I want to play, but let's just... Let's just... I don't know, man. I, I start to feel bad for these guys, bro. I start to feel bad for these guys right here. Now, that's how I could be playing the game, but I'm not going to do that. You know what I'm saying? Like, well, it's not that I'm not going to do that. It's just I don't want to do that because I could just do this Tyreek Hill and Patrick Mahomes combination and win 30 games in a row. I'm not going to do nothing until I need to in the red zone. Stay in front of him. I know he's going to get a lot of yards, but if you stay in front of him, you'll be all right. I don't know if this guy can get outside leverage on me, bro. Okay, so that, I guess that was on purpose. I don't 
see nobody I like. I don't like nothing. Okay, so this is where this part of the scheme comes in. Check this out. I'm going to teach you guys something right now, okay? Watch this. To get your yards, I'm going to flip the play. I'm going to set it up the way I do, okay? Hitch RB. Tight in on a delay fade. Go ahead and do this right here. Delay fade this guy. Oh, too late. Never mind. He messed up. He messed up. Hardman for the one play touchdown. The delay fade, if he would have stayed back there, I could have just hit the delay fade. I just haven't been using him this game. I don't use him unless I'm playing someone really good. Pretty much. I guess I'm what I like to say, I'm, I'm a little lazy. All right, I'm a little lazy when it comes to doing that. Only if I have to, I'll pull out everything. This game, I really don't need to, so... Go, oh, baby. I don't know if I showed you guys this, but I'm going to show you right here before the game's over the delay fade uh, that I'm talking about. Whenever you're trying to throw like deeper passes, you can actually implement this if you want. A lot, a lot of the top players like to run this. So let's try to do this real quick. So what you're gonna do is I'm gonna watch his user right here. He goes back. I release the tight end. Money. Call timeout. Same thing. Over and over. He can't do nothing about it. There's literally nothing he can do. Are you gonna, what route are you gonna play, homie? You know what I'm saying? Like what are we doing? What route are we gonna play? Shout out to Oh No, it's the D86 man. You played well. Defense was on point. The schemes, everything was on point. Make sure you guys drop a like. Subscribe if you're new. A lot of the stuff that I showed you in today's video will work in Madden 21. Pretty much the same. Love you guys, man. Peace.